Hi guys and welcome to today's episode on the Big Brother Niger J session. It's Tammy and I just want to say a big thank you to everyone that has been subscribing, sharing and liking. But guys, please don't forget to keep sharing, keep subscribing and keep liking. So today, first off, we have for you the cross case ship. Lately, the housemates have been giving serious tension in their ships. Sasuke and Cross have been all up in each other's faces for a while and we sure do feel the vibe between them. In a conversation they had trying to settle things between their entanglements, a lot was said. Cross accused Sasuke of not giving him a chance because she feels he is a bad boy. She however pushed back saying she is giving him a chance but he is not seeing it. She continued by saying she was not going to go out of her way to show it because he also wasn't exactly showing his feelings for her. Cross pushed on saying still that Sasuke saw him as a flirt whereas she was the bigger flirt who was also giving signals to other men. Everyone knows so well that J Paul has a thing for Sasuke and in all sincerity Sasuke has actually been giving more attention to J Paul but also still doesn't want Cross to stop giving attention. What's going on there? Now following this conversation they had, Cross and Sasuke have been spotted together having their deep conversations once again but this time around it didn't seem that they were settling differences. It seemed like they had settled their differences and now it was time to make it up. Also, Cross had decided to lose his dreads. A big decision he made there. Although Sasuke spoke to him about treating it better or either cutting it off and regrowing, whether the decision he made was to impress Sasuke or was something he has always been wanting to do, we can't exactly tell. But we can only pick a side and pick what we want to believe. But personally, I feel his decision had to do with both factors. We can see that a conversation can actually change things for good. Also, respecting the bro code, J Paul has decided to back off from Sasuke, seeing that Cross seems to be intentional about his feelings for Sasuke. Cross case shippers, let's get to it. Moving on, we have a melodious apology for Biggie. Apparently, the Big Brother Niger shiny eye housemates had accused Biggie of not doing anything for them. What a very strong accusation. I'm sure they probably forgot who they were dealing with. The news of an apology to Big Brother came with their weekly groceries, which they bought on Sunday. The housemates went back and forth, wondering how an appropriate apology could be tendered. White Money started composing a tune which eventually became their redemption song. The housemates gathered around the living room area and joined in the song while all were on their knees. They sang their apology to Big Brother. Maria closed it off with a poetry-like outro, thanking Big Brother for all the food and replenishments made available to them in the house. Let's hope Big Brother accepts their musical apology. Otherwise, they'd have to come up with something bigger and better. I mean, they are a group of wonderful creatives in the house. Finally, we have winners of the week. The housemates had to put their creativity to play in three of the tasks that they had to perform this week. Three of these tasks were brought by Storm Body Spray, Darling and Techno. Firstly, for the Storm Body Spray task, they had to come up with different creative ideas and suitable jingles for a commercial for Storm Body Spray. The housemates were divided into four teams to carry out this task and Team Love, which included Angel, Cross, Sasuke, Yusef and White Money, won this task. They've won the sum of 1,500,000 Naira. Congratulations to them. Now moving on, the second task, the Darling task, required them to do three things. Give a narrative of how their air styles made them bold, daring and unstoppable. Also, they had to model their looks and finally there was a dance segment. The winners were Team Braid, comprising of Liquor Rose, Yusef, Queen, Michael and JMK. Their reward is the sum of 750,000 Naira each. And finally, the Techno task. This was also in parts. The housemates had to go through a phase of two teaser games on Scrambler and X-Rush. And finally, the last part was a presentation addressing social issues. Each team had different social issues to address, but the winning team for this task had to address social issues on drug abuse. The winning team was Team Exclusive, which comprises of Liqua Rose, Pere, Emmanuel, White Money and Michael. They have won 3 million naira to be shared amongst each other. The winnings for this week has put Liqua Rose at the top with a sum of 1,650,000 naira. Yusef following with a sum of 1,050,000 naira and finally White Money with a sum of 900,000 naira. Those are the winnings for the three tasks that the housemates have performed. 
Well, that's a whole lot of money made in one week. But still, congratulations to them. And that's all I have for you guys today on the Big Brother Niger Gist. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Thank you very much.